Hey guys, welcome back to Making Everyday Magic. My name is Shauna. If you are new here, we are in our fifth year of homeschooling, which is rapidly drawing to a close. Today, I am sharing you, sharing you, I am sharing with you my end of month update for April. Guys, before we go any further, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. As always, you can find me down in the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic. I'm also going to do another shameless plug for my other channel, Suitcase Princess. Please, please, please go subscribe. I need all the love that I can get over there. We're sharing tons more homeschool field trip things because I simply do not have the space here on this channel. Uh, Tis a little bit of a busy season, what with the curriculums and all. So lots of things happening all at once. Not enough space here, not enough days in the week. So please go check out Suitcase Princess and hit that big subscribe button. I would love you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, guys, April, what is happening? I feel like we just started the school year and now it is like done, done. And then like 2022, like it's like halfway done. I have no idea what's happening, but it is like whoo, zipping. And part of it, I think I've just been real busy, which makes it go real fast and insane. I feel like every time I turn around, it's like Thursday night. It's it's weird. It's weird and crazy. Um, okay, so the updates. Let's start with homeschool because homeschool is just really exciting right now. Um, I am chomping at the bit for the Timberdoodle scheduler customizer to go live and it's not yet and um, it's fine and I'm sending them good vibes, good vibes, good vibes, but like I really want them to like make it live, make it live, make it live. I want it. I don't think I'm going to qualify for a kit. Okay, so maybe one, maybe, but I won't actually know until I like Jenga it shell game, figure out because I'm adding a little and take, you know, snip tucking the whole thing. And, and I don't want to order anything else from anywhere else until I know what I'm getting from there because, you know, you know what I'm saying? Um, so I will be filming that, sharing that whenever I can, but I don't know when that will be. Yeah, but I know, I know I'm, I'm doing some Amazon, uh, Timber Doodle, um, Rainbow Resource, I think, and maybe even some stuff straight from All About Learning Press. I don't know, a lot of things. I, I already did my history class, that's done. Um, I have a lot of things, I have a lot of things. Oh, something else I'm gonna start doing this next month. So be sure to follow us over at Making Everyday Magic on, um, on Instagram is I think what I wanna do is go through and have a video of just like, bullet pointing the things for each subject, right? Or at least like the main things. Like, you know, math, secular options, boom. Science, science is a big one, secular options, boom. Which reminds me, I just got this amazing unit study on dirt from uh, North Star. It is amazing, amazing. She hit me up over on Instagram and was like, hey, would you be interested in this? I was like, um, secular science, resources to share, please, please, please tell me more. And then it was about dirt. You guys may not know this, but my second child um, is not crazy. She is, like my first kid never wanted to get dirty and my second kid will not not get dirty. So she goes out in the yard and just digs like crazy. So sh we are so excited about this unit from North Star. We are so excited. So and I'll be sharing more about that. Anyways, but what I wanna do, I'm gonna link it down below cause she's awesome and amazing and a homeschool mom herself like that. You know, I love those, I love those. Anyways, so I wanna do like a whole video like secular science, a whole video like secular history. And while it may not be things I use guys because I don't, I don't necessarily like swap things up a lot. I need you, I need your input, I need you. I'm gonna do not a story because those like responses go away, I think too quickly for me to like get them. Um, but I think I'm gonna do a post. So look for the post. I'm thinking just like boom, secular science, bing. And then right on that, I want everybody to come and share with me, give me like the name and then like why it's great or even just the name. Just we need the resources. I'm, I wanna get them all in one place. If I look for that over there on Instagram, then it'll be there in a post all the time. And then I'll make a video of it here. That'll be up all the time because just like a, 
you know, like, you know what I'm saying? Like how Kathy Duffy has like the reviews. I'm not saying we're going to be that cool. Cause I mean, she's done this a long time, but something like that, where it's just kind of like a one-stop shop, have a, as much as we can in one place. And then if there's anything I forget or anything I miss or anything I don't have a chance to get to, we can leave it in the comments. So again, it's all in like one place. So I think that would be super helpful. And I want to start doing that. Um, since this is the end of April, probably May, I think it's a good idea. Anyways, so do something like that and then sprinkle it in with like, you know what I'm using, all of our normal homeschool curriculum -y stuff that to do the, cause there's so much I don't use that you guys know about. There's so much I've learned about because you guys told me. So you are the wealth of information. We just need to get it from you all in like one spot. Okay, so that's the goal. I'm really excited about that. Uh, that could be like homeschool and business. Business, business is going really well. I am, oh, back on homeschool, not done yet. Okay, so like we are at the end, y'all. Like one, senioritis is hard because now I'm like, skip it. Um, so I need to rein that in because that's a little bit of a problem. Get it finished strong. Woo. Uh, but like today was Marilyn's last, all that reading level two, boom, we are done. So I'm going to fill up the certificate, let, let her have chocolate milk. You guys know that's our celebration for end of anything is a chocolate milk. Um, so she's excited. And also like suddenly I feel like she, like we got a click and like is reading, like is reading, is reading like with the whole, you know, you guys know what I'm talking about. It's like a ha ha and the heavens opened up and it turned like golden and people saying it was glorious. Okay. So that is where we are. And that's super awesome. We are wrapping things up with a neat little bow. We've got like two weeks left. I think total. It is awesome. It is awesome. It is awesome. Business. Business is going really well. It's the busy season here for this channel because like curriculum and homeschool is all like ramped up really crazy right now, which is great. Um, and we've got a lot of things going on on the other channel with like homeschooling field trips because it's the season for that and like travel and things. It's just really exciting and going really well. My shop, my business is uh, for a little while, man, it was like 100 miles an hour and now it's like 95. So that was good. It's good. Like busy enough, really good, but also I'm not drowning, which is pretty sweet. Um, okay. So home life, guys. It has been, I think tomorrow is like my husband's 60 days or something like back in the office at this job, more hours, but also like different hours, I guess we're making it. I know for a little while, I didn't think that it would happen, but we have fallen into like, we're getting it sorted. Like we're not through the woods, no, but we are like, we're getting there. You know what I mean? Like I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. We're getting there. Plus. Now knowing what I know now, I will not do some of the things that I have done to myself because it wasn't an issue. So we'll spread our dance out a little more. We will not take on as many things because there for a little while, guys, we were doing all the dance and dad had just gone back to work and we were doing swimming every day and soccer on Wednesdays, like, and school and businesses and like, we are finding things that are helping us. And so, yep, cleaning people coming, yep. Yep, huge help. Uh, we've also figured out the days that we need to cook in order to like live life because I mean, I just can't every day. I just can't. Um, so that's nice. And we're just, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're not great yet. We are getting it. And that is amazing. Um, so that I just, guys, that is like a weight off. You have no idea. I do personal. Okay, so let's move to personal. Personal. I've really been tracking and making sure that I'm getting my gallon of water a day. Love it. Feel better when I do. I've been really consistent with my vitamins. Really good. I'm making sure I'm getting like a really good amount of protein in my body. Also very good. I'm feeling very good. Now I am sleeping good. I'm sleeping well. So that's good. Sleep is going well, but I have got to get back into the habit of getting up before my kids, like not, I mean, I get up before my kids, but like getting up early enough to be fully functional that I can work before my kids get up. You got that because I've slacked off with that so hard and it's not bad. I mean, I'm still waking up at like 545, but like, I think if I were up at five, like I know I find great success with, it's like a whole other ball game because I'm, I need to do a better job of keeping like this work out of their waking hours because when I try to do both, I'm not as successful. And I feel like there's more things I want to do with them. Like literally just downtime, those things, I want to have downtime with them and play time and go do the fun things. So I'm, I need to do a better job of making my hiney get out of bed earlier so that I can get more work done 
earlier so that I can then do more fun stuff with them later. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, yeah. I just filmed the question and answer video and I was like, how do you make it work? Well, you just, you got it. You got it. But then also I got to get up. That's how, that's how I do that. And I'm not like a stay up late person. I don't like to go to bed at a different time than my husband. Like I like to go to bed together. Um, and also I'm like falling asleep at 10 o'clock because I'm an old lady. So for me, I got to do ahead of time. And then I'm doing great if I am like full speed when they're like, you know what I mean? So that's good. And I have to get it all done when they're not up yet. I just have to get enough done that then once they're done with like their little morning, like by the time we hit school, then, you know, I've got like a system that I need to get back into my system that I know is successful. I just must do it, which I know you guys feel me on that sometimes is the hardest part. Anyways, that. So I am excited. There's a lot coming up. I am looking forward to our end of, end of school year. Checkups are coming up in a, a couple weeks. Like it is good. I feel like the last time I was here, I was like, oh my gosh, like I'm like frazzled hair and like crazy lady. Um, but this lady is optimistic. Am I like out of the woods? No, but do I know I will be sometime? I hope. Yeah. So that's might be as good as that gets. I know you guys feel me. I know you do. I know that you understand just being a parent stinking hard, man. And then we said, Hey, let us also be teachers. <laughs> what were we thinking? No, it's rewarding. It's amazing. We, we love it. We love it. But whew, some of them days, y'all, some of them days. Anyways, it's going well. That's what you need to know. Yes. Yes. Anyways, I hope that you found this helpful, entertaining, or informative. Probably just entertaining. Hopefully it's something. Hopefully you found something. Um, other than that, guys, thanks for all of the support. Always scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, give this video a thumbs up, and uh, head on down to the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic, or head on over to Suitcase Princess and follow along on some of our homeschool fun stuff. Like tomorrow, we are going to um, the Pleasure Pier in Galveston, which I've never been to. I've been on the pier um, because it used to be the flagship hotel and I stayed there one time, but I've never like done this thing. I've done all like Kima and all the other Landry stuff, but I've never done this. I'm real excited. Uh, and it's homeschool day. So I don't know what that makes any different. I think they have educational talks in the after. I don't know. I don't know. But follow along. It's going to be fun. It's going to be amazing. And that will be over on Suitcase Princess. So 